I grew up playing hockey and street hockey and, and wanting to, to play uh, professional hockey. I didn't you know, set out to be an academic. Um, started working on the ants because of the, the fascination I had with them in terms of their symbiotic association of, with, with the fungi that grow for food. One of the things that I discovered was that the ants uh, utilize bacteria f for production of antibiotics that help protect their fungus garden. And so um, this was, uh, at the time, you know, the only really known other case of an animal utilizing bacteria for deriving antibiotics for dealing with disease, you know, humans being obviously the, uh, the other one. And one of the important things about drug discovery and, and work is, is discovering new co compounds. And so the more new compounds you discover and are, that are identified, um, the more we have to uh, screen and look for uh, to use as potential drugs uh, for, for human use. When I discovered that the ants have bacteria that produce antibiotics, it was um, the, the discovery was partly based on the observation that the ants can be completely covered in these bacteria. And so you can actually see the bacteria on the bodies of the ants. And so in the fungus growing ant system, what we do is we scrape that visual growth of the bacteria onto uh, nutrient plates. And so we culture the bacteria, we get it in pure culture. And then what we can do is we can take that organism, that microbe in a plate, and we can do bioassays against other organisms and look for uh, whether these bacteria produce uh, small molecules or antibiotics that affect the growth of other microbes. We're studying the symbiosis between the ants and the microbes to understand the breakdown of plant biomass. And this can be uh, useful uh, in terms of our own u attempts to break down plant biomass to, to produce ethanol for, as, a, as a bioenergy fuel. If we discover an enzyme that's really, a f you know, or a suite of enzymes that are very efficient in breaking down plant cell walls in the system, which we, you know, we think we're likely to do because um, uh, the system is highly evolved to, to break down plant cell walls, um, those enzymes could be integrated into an industrial process where they're utilized in the, you know, the steps of putting plant biomass into the industrial process, uh, adding the enzymes, uh, likely using a pretreatment, adding the enzymes to convert uh, the cellulose from the plant cell walls into simple sugars that can be then fermented into ethanol.